Welcome back to the MMCast Late Night Commander Game Show. I am your host, Alex Kessler, here with my wonderful co-hosts and special guests, Ben, Zach, and Jonathan. Hello, everyone. What up? What's up, man? We are Hello. He- we are here playing Commander. We got new decks. We got someone cheering, hoping John wins. Uh, we got a bunch of high friends. <laughs> <laughs> um, someone has said not his Coralash deck, which makes me terrified. Uh, we are Jamie Commander Game, if you don't know, and you're joining uh, to see some of our guests. It's the first time here on Monday nights. Uh, we are we do this every Monday night at 7.30, and this lives on YouTube starting on Tuesdays as a VOD. Um and we just always have cool guests on it. Hey, we have cool guests. It's it's the main move is having people that are cool on. And luckily tonight we have people that are cool. Uh, first, uh, and we're going to do this in turn order, and then we're going to do a little bit of a, a deck tech. Zach, uh, introduce yourself to the class. And uh, what are you playing tonight? What's up? I'm Zach. I'm uh, a co-host on Commander Social. That's uh, a podcast uh, for a casual commander. on comes out on Wednesdays. And I also stream with... Uh, CMDR Hideaway on Wednesdays. Um, my deck is uh, Rograth, or I call him Roger and Arden. Uh, mm-hmm. It's it's basically Swords deck, and then like other equipment, it does Borosy things that you would expect it to do. It's, uh, uh, be aggressive, be be aggressive. Well, now Boros yeah, does a whole whole bunch of new stuff. I mean, as a as the <clears throat> as a professed. Lorehold student, uh, I, I would I will not take any red white slander on on, <laughs> especially as you're representing the red white architects of the world, uh, artificers and archaeologists, more R sci- a based science words uh, with Arden. Arden. He's even an archaeologist. It's in, even in his name. We got Indiana Jones in the house. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Uh, awesome. Thank you so much for being on. And John Dina, how how are you this evening? I'm good. Hey guys, it's it's glad to I'm glad to see a lot of uh, pack club hype over in the chat. People saying they wish that I would win. Uh, I don't know. I'm I'm pretty um pretty scared of that R- Roger deck. <laughs> uh, I'm Jonathan Medina. I do a uh, pack opening stream um, on Twitch, and uh, yeah, I'm a, I'm a longtime Magic content creator. I'm pl- playing the first card that I ever had a crush on, and that is Corlash, heir to Black Blade. When I first started playing in um, I think it was Time Spiral Block. Uh, this card, I was like, oh man, it gets so huge. Like, I want to play that card. So I traded Tarmogoyfs to get a playset of Corlash, and I never looked back, you know? Hey, I mean, if, as long as you're playing them still, it doesn't matter what you trade <laughs> for. I don't think they're the same Corlashes, but, you know, <laughs> in my heart, you know, in yeah. spirit, they're the same. Yeah. Corlash, heir to Blackblade. Is that what you have in mind there? Yeah, yeah. No? The, the, he he gets big for all the swamps I control, so he gets he's a grandeur card. I, those those five grandeur legends are five of my favorites. I've tried to like make Lanessa Zephyrmage work in modern a bunch of times. Oh, I like yeah. I'm convinced I'm convinced that there's like some version of that deck that works. I have I own like four copies of foil Lanessas because of it. Oh man, at the LGS I always ask, hey, do you mind if I run a core lash in my deck so I can grandeur it? You know, <laughs> uh, obviously I don't have it here now because it's not legal, but uh, I do ask at the LGS. <laughs> oh, I mean, if you wanted to, we would we would allow it. We're not we're not. Um... We're fans of the rule of zero here in this house. <laughs> I'll know. I'll know for next time. Perfect, I'll know for perfect. next time. I'll bring a second quarter. Yeah, I'll, I'll bring Paradox Engine next time. So. <laughs> <laughs> slight, slight different level of danger. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Abusing grandeur and ability invented before Commander existed versus Paradox Engine. <laughs> uh, <laughs> although we do have some Paradox Engine hype, so who am I to disagree with chat? And uh, uh, third, third in line, Mr. Ben Bateman. Uh, whomst, whomst may you be? fellow co-host and what what's may you be playing um i may be the co-host of the show and <laughs> i am playing nimrus una's trickster um it is a commander i've never played before it's kind of a bit of a shenanigans pile because um this was previously my my uh cast not cast god i'm so out of it um my <laughs> my sig river cutthroat deck um so it's kind of built to be that, but then also we had like a brief stint where you and I played a bunch of CDH. So then that became my CDH SIG deck, which isn't fun at all. So I just took out 15 of the like least fun cards and replaced them with like just generally sweet cards. So now we're just going to see what happens. But Nimrus is really cool, just like a really sweet commander. Um, I'm a little afraid that this deck is going to do only one thing. That's just draw cards. 
<laughs> which like <laughs> I'm all about Not doing, but like thing. you have to be able to win. Um, so yeah, we'll see how Nimrus Una's trickster works out. As long as it doesn't counter spells, I'm good with it, man. No problem there. Yeah. Oh, yeah. This deck does, definitely doesn't counter any spells. No, no. Okay, cool. Definitely cool. don't <laughs> expect the counter spell, uh, nor the Inquisition. <laughs> um, and uh, I am Alex Gessler, host of this <laughs> host of this show, along with Ben and all of the other things we do. Uh, I am playing a uh, Jessica Thrace Reborn Rehan Obosh uh trio of decks which i call tpose.deck because every single one of the commanders is doing the tpose and just screaming at the sun uh and um i'm gonna try doing a lot of damage with one thing <laughs> oh, no. uh, and try doing math there's gonna be doubling there's gonna be tripling there's gonna be more doubling there that's it i don't think there's quadrupling i don't think quadrupling exists on a magic card yet but maybe one day um Hey, Egg Plays Cards. Hey, Sloth Mancer. Hey, everyone. Uh, there's just a lot. So uh, I'm doing... This is my first Jun decking commander as well. I am a, 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 a avid modern Jun player. And I've always just like kind of felt like most of the commander options in Jun were boring uh like you or, or just bad and so it was when i figured out oh i can make obosh work it was a challenge and uh it's dope only one drops three drops and five drops in this deck i guess there is a wow. uh there is a foretell not foretell what's a fuse a fuse double sided double face card that technically i could cast for seven mana but that's it those mm. are those are the only converted mana costs and lands um so we'll we'll see how this does uh Stay tuned for turns one, three, and five. <laughs> um, Wing Zero has a point there. Corvold is a pretty sick John Commander. Corvold, no Corvold is in the deck. Uh, Corv okay. My All problem right. with Corvold as a John Commander is that Corvold is uh, maybe too strong, and by that it's just like boringly strong. You like draw cards <clears throat> for doing the thing you're obviously going to do. Yeah, it also puts a target on you, right? Because you're yeah. just like, oh, you're playing Corvold. I'm gonna smash you because. I don't want to die to Corbel. I'm I'm a hipster at heart. I need to be doing something different or weird and not the thing that uh, is very easy to do. Uh, I guess, and that's the problem with Corvold. And this is this is then he's in here. He's hanging out. He costs five mana conveniently, which is one of the converted mana costs I'm allowed to play. Uh, <laughs> for those who don't know, because Obosh <laughs> is not one of the cards that can have just easily selected. I will throw Obosh on screen instead of this planar bridge from last week. Uh, as long as Scryfall loads and stops being not cool. Oh, bosh. There's only one. There we go. Also in a T-pose. Just, they have like 17 arms versus two. Uh, like just got right on. Say, how does that work with Obosh with all those arms? But I guess, yeah. Look at the, they're the, screaming into the sun, hands out to the side. <laughs> and slightly <laughs> to the top and slightly to the bottom. <laughs> uh, all right. So uh, the way this is going to work is I'm going to randomize turn order uh, using this convenient button. Uh, and then I'm going to roll off to see who goes first. Uh, if one through five, it's me. Six through 10, it's Ben. Uh, 11 through uh, 15, it's John, and 16 through 20, it's Zach. Uh, it's me. I'm going first. I rolled a perfect one, uh, which in every other game I've ever rolled a d20 would be bad, but today it uh, worked out. So I'm going to draw my hand. Does everyone have hands that are keepable and is happy with their lives moving forward? Uh, I'll do that uh, now. I didn't know when they were going to do that. Yeah. I am good with my hand. My hand is already looking good. <laughs> Rigged. Uh, mm, it, it got much worse with when I picked the other ones up. Um, thank uh, you, Tony yeah. and Dan, uh, for the gifted subs to Tony and no, no, no one Han Solo, which is also a good. Yeah, Logan and Tony gifting those subs. I like to see it. Super appreciated. You love to see it. And then uh, thank you for following all the people that followed in between now and when we started and uh, most recently confused Colin because you were last. And that's how um, from now on I'll remember to read names. <laughs> uh, I'm ready to go when people are. I'll keep. I'm ready to roll. All right. I yeah. am yeah, going to play this command tower and I'm going to play this goose and I'm going to make a food token uh, and then I'm going to pass the turn. I'm going to draw for the turn, too. I feel like that's an important feature to Magic the Gathering. Is yeah, drawing. You don't want to give, <laughs> drawing, yeah. give up that draw there. <laughs> it's important. Is drawing cards on your turn. Oh, what's up, Ryan? Thank you for the follow, Green a Geek. Or Green Geek. 
There's an E in the middle. I don't know if I'm supposed to pronounce it. <laughs> treasure clue. Treasure. I might not have a food token. That might be the one token. <laughs> I was digging through boxes trying to find tokens for tonight. Oh my gosh. I'm missing some tokens. Wait, and I forgot what? to get my dice too. Jessica's so powerful? What the hell? Oh, yeah, yeah. this is the first time reading. Yeah, Jessica... Whoa. Does a lot. <laughs> she has a lot of words of text on, yeah. her, on herself. Wait, don't she, don't she, She's in my 99. Deal combat damage to one of your opponents. Deals triple that damage. Why am I not playing that card in all my decks, Alex? That's like my... That card is designed for me. That's why we do shows like this, so you can learn what cards you should be playing. Now you've learned. You're cheating. You're cheating. <laughs> I'm, all right. Yes. Um, <laughs> um, whose turn is it? Oh, is it my turn? I'm second. It's your turn. Got it. Didn't realize that. Uh, this, this, um, this, this conveniently shaped plant man uh, dragon is going to be my food token. I Sweet is an egg executor, right? Yeah, Alolan executor. This is my favorite Pokemon. Yeah. This is uh, this is from Inkling Customs. I'm like part of her Patreon, so I get like a cool oh, custom sweet. token every month. I have all of the, not all of the cast of Avatar. I'm missing Earthbenders. Uh, she skipped the head of the line and gave me an Executor, which is nice because plant tokens are common enough. <laughs> I'm going to play Forbidden Orchard here. Um, so here's the, here's the deal. Um, Jonathan, if here, I, yo, yeah. if I make you a one, one right now, will you attack yeah. Alex on your turn? I don't have anything to attack. But if I oh, with the one, one, one. Oh yeah. yeah, absolutely. Yeah. You'd hit him for sure. Yeah. 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 I have Same. a zero two right. blocker. <laughs> ah, well, never, well, never. You'll, have to, you'll have to trade it in, bro. <laughs> it's a why do I have to trade it's it? Zero two. It's yeah, a, it would block really well. It yeah, would block really well. Yeah. Oh, it's a zero How'd two. You, it's a zero two. Yeah, yeah. It's a How goose. do you get a zero two yeah. so fast? Gilded goose. It's one green mana for a zero two. That <laughs> makes a food token. And like all, all the, he's the combat trick. <laughs> what if I giant yeah. growth? That's true. Oh. That's true. I would probably just due to fear, maybe just let you. Well, how you're in black. I actually no. I think I would block. <laughs> He's the only one that I want to be attacked, so I'm not going to make you a token. Go ahead. Okay. All right. I hear you. I hear you. Um, so you're done, right? Yes. I'm. I'm quickly going to go grab a bottle of water because I forgot to do that. Uh, and I recommend other people have water because chat can make us drink water, as I learned last week. I'm going to play a wayfarer bob wayfarer bobble. Whoop. And then I'm gonna pass my turn. I'm gonna draw for turn. Uh, I'm gonna play Roger. Oh no! Uh, I'm gonna play Battlefield Forge and Seiko. I'm gonna need that one one to block, Ben. <laughs> Just in case, you know. Aha, I hold all the cards. I hold all got, the one ones. He's got menace. Oh yeah! Daniel, yeah. Daniel's hooking it up with drawing a card. Who's gonna draw, Daniel? It's me. It's me. It's on you, Alex. Mm. I think oh, you, you went to, to go get, get some, some water. water. I'm back. Chat. I have my water. I am hydrated. I gave people some free usage of points. Who's drawing a card? Medina is drawing a card. <laughs> yeah. Spicy. Sick. I'll draw a card. Uh, I'm gonna Thank play you, this here swamp. I think I'm going to get out a early Rayhan. Oh, okay. And pass the turn. All right, guys. Who wants to? Who, so, who would like a one-one here? Who wants to be on my team? Who wants to be on Team Bateman? I, I was already there, man. Look at I, I have it written. I'm I'm on the team, bro. <laughs> All right. So, Medina, you have my back if I give you a one-one. Yeah, unless you don't want me on the team, then like you know, I'll be the last one picked. Uh, like, like in high you can school. be on my team, dude. You can be on my team. You oh, really? Is it more worth it to be on your team? Why do you want to be? Why do you want to Ben on to be on your team? <laughs> no, I'm Medina on my team. Oh, you want Medina oh, on your team? That's different. Like that, That's spicier. That's what I'm talking about, dude. Alex, what I if we do something the most, out of the ordinary? Man. I gotta be and You and I make an alliance. Uh, the Bateman. Can... The, the Bateman. I can be I can be convinced to form alliances. I'm I am pro. Of course alliances. you could. I would never make an alliance with you. That's wow. a test. <laughs> wow. All right, got, Medina, just, Medina, just, Medina, I'm giving you a one-one spirit. It's colorless. It doesn't fly. John and Zach, just look at how you played with my heart and tore it out. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> right. Not to be trusted. <laughs> that's what co-hosts are for. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah um, co-host therapy. <laughs> that move. 
that was a sick move the way I just like played with Alex's heart. That was great. Um, all right, let's go with this River of Tears. I'm gonna tap two. Um, yeah, but <laughs> I guess I, don't know if I just want to give like another one one. But Dina, a lot of. A lot of power I'm giving you if I give you two power. Oh man! Just spread the love. You could spread it around. You could spread it around, man. Well, there's no need to make deals so early, you know. It's just uh, it's true. Yeah. Just give everybody. Just lights. give everyone some one ones. He did get a free draw card, so I got a free draw card. No, John did. Oh yeah, He's yeah. Because Daniel hooked it up in the chat. My boy Morgan in the chat wants to buy packs. Just, um, <laughs> just buy packs for people. Yo, guys, check this <laughs> out. Oh Ooh, yeah, nice. Haven, what's up? <laughs> okay, well I guess I'll uh I guess I'll tap here and make a hmm. Yeah, I guess I'll tap and make a uh, a thing. Another one one here. And let's give it to let's give it to you, Zach. Um and I'll i I'll cast a signet. You get a one one sp spirit thing. Arcane Zach, signet, there you Zach, go. Zach, our plan is working. He just gave us our one ones. Yeah. Sick. All right, I'm done. <laughs> so <laughs> Time to lay the beats. <laughs> this is bad for me. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. Um, let's play. I'm going to play this uh, Rogue's Passage. Mm hmm. Seven cards. Um, oh, yeah. Let's put everyone who is uh, a sub. You get to just throw Baby Yoda soups in the chat. <laughs> <laughs> Baby Yoda! We'll have more emotes soon. We do need more. I have them all unlocked. I just have to get them like designed in, in Tron. <laughs> Hashtag Team 1-1. Um, I feel so left out. I have a 0-2 and a 3-3. Three, three. I'm going to pass the turn, and I'll just leave up my Wayfarer's Bobble and my, my untapped mana. I'll draw for turn. Uh, that's card. Um, I'm gonna play a planes. Tap both of these. Tap the forge for colorless for a uh, talisman and conviction. All right. And I'll pass. Talisman of conviction, which I'm assuming is the red white talisman. Yeah. Dope. Alphabetically yeah, this first. Is one. All right, uh, I'm going to untap. I'm going to draw. I'm going to play Blood Crypt untapped. Lose two life. Ooh. Here comes that three drop. Uh, the deck only has two types of or three types of cards. Uh, I'm going to play Rishkar, Pima Renegade. Oh, oh that card's sweet. Ooh. Ooh, thank you for the uh, sub gift, Danny. Um... Uh, and then I'm going to put a plus one, plus one counter on this goose. And I'm going to put a plus one, plus one counter on themselves. Um, oh, man. That's, that's such a modern move right there, what you're doing. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and then I'm going to play... Ooh, do we want to have fun? I feel like he's do so it. small right now, though. And that's... Well, that doesn't really do anything. Yeah, let's just get this guy on play. And then we can we can play around with what to do with him later. I'm going to tap the Goose and Rayhan to play uh, Capricopian. Which is a Goat Hydra. Uh, which is just <laughs> one of the best creature types in Magic. <laughs> um, That's great. Uh, so let me bring it up. Oh, oh thank God. Uh, yay for putting on caps and bottles. Water bottles. Capri... Oh god, that's not descriptive enough with an I. <laughs> How many? There we go. Capricopian. Uh, it is a uh, X green goat hydra zero zero. It enters the battlefield with X plus one plus one counters on it. Pay two and put a plus one plus one counter on Capricopian. Then you may reselect which player it's attacking. Only the player it's attacking may activate this ability and only during the declare attacker step. And it can attack. It cannot attack me. Due to the way the rules of magic work, you can't attack yourself. It is a one-one though, mm. so it's just a small one-one for that now that we're gonna play hot right. potato with in the future. <laughs> um, and I'm done. That was my turn. Gotcha. Okay. 
Um, tap, draw. Gonna play this Scalding Tarn. Ooh, expensive cards. Well, they're all proxies. Fair enough. And uh, crack it. Here, my graveyard does matter, so I guess my, I'm just gonna keep my commander off the table until I play it. Just have my graveyard here. Uh, I'll go to 39. I'm gonna get a some kind of good land here, and I'm gonna cast a Demir Signet with it. Um, and then I'm gonna pass the turn. All right, I'm gonna crack my bobble. Go grab one oh. of these swamps. I'll allow it. Thank you. I appreciate that. You're welcome. We are on a team anyway. Yeah, so we're on a team, so it's all good. Mm, one of you, I'm gonna let one of you decide who this goat hydra eventually attacks. <laughs> <laughs> Alex, so, I want um, you to remember, victory, right? They have one ones. They have one ones that can block the goat hydra. But I'm happy to give you a one one if you want to balance it out, so you don't attack me with the goat hydra. <laughs> well, but if I attack you first, Ben, you can use your mana to decide who it attacks second. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> that's, that's... He's like, I would just rather it not attack me. Then I don't have to decide. That's fair. You know, valid, valid. It is. It is like a, it is a tricky political card, right? Because you know, if someone picks, I'm going to attack this person. Then that person's like, Yo, man, why'd you do that? Mm -hmm, okay, here we mm -hmm, go. I'm going to draw. Mm -hmm. Alex, what's right, your feeling right. on the whole um, re-edited, remastered Obi Wan versus Vader fight? The one with like the new effects. Do you think it's cool, or do you think it's kind of lame? I think it's cool. It's really cool that fans made it. I, I think it would be kind of lame if Disney made that. But like, if fans want to make cool content, I'm all about it. I need to check this out. I want to play a Sword of the Animist and see if it resolves. No effects here, bro. I am a Jun to play. Yeah, no effects. Uh, no effects here on the Sword of the Animus. The stack is I'm not where I interact. My, I'm gonna put my one one spirit <clears throat> on it, and I'm gonna give it to. I'm gonna give it to Alex. It's you're, gonna trigger. Oh, you're attacking me with your spirit token. I do have a three three. That's fine. Okay. It's gonna trigger, and I'm gonna go get a swamp. What is it? It's a two two. It's a two two. And you're yeah, tap. You're tapped out. It doesn't have menace or anything, right? Right. Right, as far as I know, yeah, one one. It's just a it says a one one plus one one. Two two. I'm so afraid. I'm gonna take two. All right. I'm gonna go get that swamp. Thank you for more of the gift subs. Currently, yeah, you're, Tony. Currently, you're just leading uh, the gift sub train. I love to see the gift subs, Tony and Daniel. Thank you so much for supporting this this cast. Thank you so much. Super appreciated. All right. After that, I'm done. I just, uh, yeah, just pass the turn. I'm shuffling right. up here. Uh, untap. Draw. Uh, I'm playing Mountain. Um, go for red. Uh, colors, color, or generic, generic. Wait. Do I have? Yeah, I do. Uh, for Outpost Siege. Oh, yeah. Uh, mm -hmm. I'll choose Cons. Is that the draw card? Is it card? the Howling Mine? I, I, yeah, I believe it, you mean Outpost Stage. As an inner, she's cons or dragons. Cons, at the beginning of your upkeep, exile top card of your library until in return you may play that card. Cool. And I will pass the turn. Uh, thank you again, Danny. <clears throat> Wow, we everyone throw some baby yeah. Yodas in the chat. We all have them some now. Love, some love. All right, I'm gonna go um, for cons. Alex, Alex, what do you think if I give you a one-one spirit token? You are you feeling like then we'd be a little more balanced out? You'd be a little less inclined to come after me. Uh, yeah, sure. All right, I'll give you a one-one. Okay. Also Man, this Forbidden Orchard is doing a lot of work for Ben, you know? <laughs> it's it's winning a lot of goodwill, you know? Uh, Oppa's yeah. going to flash gonna be a in this dimensional token. infiltrator, anyone? <laughs> oh! That, that exiles when it hits, right? It eats a card? Uh, no. this is It's blue one for a 2-1 flash flying devoid. Um, and then it has this ability of uh, colorless and a wingding. 
Target opponent exiles the top card of his or her library. If it's a land card, you may return dimensional land to its owner's hand. Uh, oh, okay. The whole idea is that because of Nimrus, I, I can like maybe get it back to my hand and continue to recast it. Ah, uh, cool, cool. Okay, I'm gonna make this board just significantly spicier, and I want I want oh, wait, everyone to wait. remember this. Is this before? This is before I, my turn. No, I I haven't t- taken my turn yet. Oh, 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 I'm sorry. I thought this was my turn. Sorry. I'll, th- this goes back to my my hand. Wow. You can have your token, Alex, just so it's so it's an available token to you because I think it's more fun. But I still have two mana open. Sorry. Hmm. I'm, I did wait, not yet cast wait, my two one. Let's pretend I don't have this token make it this mana. Mm. Mana is confusing this way. Just untap your mana. I don't need the token. Um, I have four mana. Seven, five, six, seven. Oh, that's eight mana. Mm, not as exciting. Ooh. 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 He doesn't need the token. So ungrateful. Oh, no, I will. I just, I just. It's confusing <laughs> that you have a floating mana through multiple phases of my turn. <laughs> <laughs> I was just supposed to, it, that was only supposed to happen at the end of the turn before yours so it would have been gone anyway it was before oh, your oh, turn oh, oh, I was oh, do, oh, doing it at it. the end of got Zach's it, turn it, it, that was all happening at the end of Zach's turn I just thought I was next oh 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 I now understand okay uh cool I am going to ask uh, for a report on how many cards each player has in their hand I don't like that one two three four five six Five. Ben? Five. Five. Okay. Um, I am going to red, green, green. Uh, I'm going to cast Jessica's Will. I'm going to, uh, because I have my commander, Four. choose both options. So I get six red mana. Thank you, John. <laughs> uh, and exile the top oh, three cards in my library. Okay. Um, I guess this isn't that worthwhile. Extended art, Jessica's Wheel too. Sweet. Yeah. Well, I, pre- I, pre- I pre-ordered... I actually, that was a good spec of mine. I pre-ordered like eight of them uh, when they were like $2 because <laughs> no one knew what was going on. I was yeah. like, this card has to be insane. <laughs> uh, <laughs> and I was right. Uh, one, two, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten mana. Okay. I remember throwing them in my giveaway pile because they were a dollar when they first <clears> came out. I was like, oh, I'll give those away. And then uh, we opened one on stream and they are like, oh, that's a ten dollar card. And I'm like, what is it like? And I checked, and I'm like, "Oh, okay, we're gonna take those out of the giveaway pile." <laughs> <laughs> um, I guess the best move here is to cast Eternal Witness, uh, grabbing Jessica's will back to my hand. Holy okay. crap! That seems reasonable. Uh, Alex is going. Alex is really going for it. And then I cast Jessica's will again. So this goes to two, and then I get another six mana. Wow. Uh, and I'll exile the next Shock and awe. Shock and awe. You're just storming off over there, man. I know. Yeah. This is great. All it's right. Net. Cool. Uh, I will then play this here forest. Right. I can play cards, right? Yeah, you may play them this turn. Sweet. Uh, and then I, so I have six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven mana. Cool. Uh, which allows me to play... Yeah, Prophet says that you you called Arclight Phoenix too. I did. That was that was like my. Yeah. That's the most money I've ever made in Magic. <laughs> yeah. I yeah, uh, like listen to Kess. Kess is a master spec. I got speculate. I got like I was in like multiple arguments online with people who were like, "This card's bad. You don't know what you're talking about." And it was like when it was two dollars as a mythic rare, and I was like, "Guys." Vengevine is a modern playable card most of the time and needs you to play with bad cards. <laughs> this has evasion and you need to play with good cards. <laughs> and so I drunkenly bought 50 copies of it <laughs> at $2. <laughs> and then it was worth $50. It was great. Um, and it's one of the few times I've sold specs because that's my biggest problem as a magic finance person is I uh, am a hoarder who has a her- terrible time selling product. Uh, all right, so but we should have me talk less and play cards uh, more. So I have a bunch of red mana. I could just play this guy who seems spicy. 
it's really not about selling the specs. It's about the internet points, just taking the picture yeah. of all the specs yeah, exactly. and being like, I exactly. did it. <laughs> so that's that. And then I have one, two, three, four, five, six. Which lets me play that. And then I'm just like creating chaos and seeing what happens. And I don't hate that. And hopefully I don't die. But I have two blockers. Alex, what did you so what did you do with all of your your all of the will of Jessica's that you created? Uh, I exiled a bunch of cards, and I'm now deciding how I'm going to play them. <laughs> He's deciding to rain chaos on the board. So mm. I am going to use the one green mana to play Birds of Paradise. Uh, I am then going to play Primal Vigor. Okay. I guess I guess this that is doubles just counters, right? super spooky. I'm going to wait before I play both of those cards, actually. I'm sorry. I'm going to play Mana Gorge or Hydra first. Okay. And then I have two, one, two. I have one mana floating, right? Because I played five. And then I'm going to play Birds of Paradise. So wait, then, Primal Vigor oh, first, no, yeah. right? Yeah, yeah, Primal Vigor. He gets one counter, and then Birds of Paradise. More. And then he gets more and counters. Then, yeah. Then go to Alex's town. Alex's board is out of control, guys. This is a fact. Yeah. Fact I told you it was a problem. We should have all tried to kill him. We should have all tried to kill him immediately. We couldn't actually do that. Like, <laughs> we, didn't have the, we didn't have the power. Or me, I had a what? I attacked him. I did two damage. Uh, and I, then I will I use the last minute I have to play Shadow Spear. <laughs> I blame you. I blame you both. I blame uh, you both. Uh, You've dropped the ball. <laughs> You've dropped the ball on this, whoa, this whoa, tyrant. Whoa, 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 whoa. You now can give two tokens to each player turn benjamin <laughs> wait why is that primal, you, primal vigor double? affects everybody it is a all people situation not a not a just me person situation oh wait we need to read that card what's the yeah, thing wait, there? what is primal <laughs> vigor I, yeah. I think it doubles tokens and it's doubling else. season for everyone oh my gosh primal vigor well, not it doesn't, it doesn't do loyalty. So it's it's if one or more tokens will be put on the battlefield, okay. twice of twice that many of those tokens are put on the oh, battlefield. Crap. If one or more okay, plus so, one plus so one it's... counters are placed on a creature, twice that many plus one plus one counters are placed on a creature instead. Jeez. So right. it, it affects end of turn, Alex. Everyone. I'm gonna play. Are, are you done? Uh, yeah. You're done, right? I did not. Pl the thing I was going to do along with Primal Vigor was play Dictator of the Gods, and I decided that oh, oh, I didn't double damage. need everyone to have double damage and double counters, as much as I would like that for myself. <laughs> I flashed in a 2 1 flyer. That is my big move. Right, I'm, <laughs> I'm going to untap, and then I'm going to draw, and then I'm going to play. All right, let me Blue organize Delta. my board. Um, wait, why am I playing so many fetch lands in a deck that has no lands to search for? This is dumb. This is this is this is this is why this was a stupid mana base made for CDH where I needed like five lands. <laughs> um, <laughs> this was dumb. Uh, all right, I'm going to. I mean, here's the deal, guys. I feel like we just need to try to attack Alex, but also I don't really want to be the one who starts because. I will. I will. Is... I will come for you. <laughs> Fair point. I mean, I don't. I don't disagree. Like, if I can get some stuff, I'll do it. Yeah. What? I'll like, if he says that to everyone, I will come for you. Then what? What does that mean? That's exactly you know? what he's going to say to everyone. Yeah. So uh... it's like either he bogs us, or like we start the beatdown. You know. All right, Alex. Yeah. I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what. I'll make you a deal. Yeah. I'll make you a deal. <laughs> yeah. I will give you Forbidden Orchard tokens, so I'll give you two tokens. <laughs> as long as you as long as you let me deal damage to you, because that's only fair. I have to get your life total down, and I have to use my stupid 2-1. <laughs> but dealing damage to you makes more sense than dealing damage to anyone else. And I'll but I'll give you I'll give you tokens. So I'm giving a, you two power. I, very, I feel like reasonable. I, I feel like you giving me two tokens for me not to attack you is <laughs> <laughs> it's the pride that wow, I was the, expecting. The negotiation right. has escalated. Let's, let's do it as let's, let's do this is a one turn deal. Okay. Uh, if you take two, okay. I'll give you two power this turn. If you don't attack me this turn, you take two, I'll give you two power. No, no, no. You, the deal was you let me attack. I'll take. I'll let you attack me with your two one, and I will. I will. I will. I will take the. I will get the two one one tokens. I no promises on who's attacking who. If you want me not to attack you, you have to not attack me. You're a villain, sir. I'm giving you either option. <laughs> you get to choose. I'm saying deals are open, but you don't get to use one... You don't get to use one token gift to get two 
different right. opportunities. All right. You know what? Fine, Alex. I won't attack you if you do not attack me. Cool. Done. But I get tokens. I need three no attack steps. I'll give you tokens. Uh, no. You get one. Two. Nope. Two no attack steps. I'll give you tokens. You get. I don't need the tokens. <laughs> I'll take them. Or the, no, or the no attack steps. He doesn't need either. <laughs> yeah, you could. I'll take two damage in the air. I'm giving you a lot. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm like, wow. Ben Bateman just made a deal of the century. Like, <laughs> all right, all right. And, then and then declined. And then declined. Okay. Deal. One attack step. I'll give you one attack step. I'll give you two power. Deal. All right. So I'm getting two um, tokens, right. and you're not right now, though. Yeah, I'm gonna do it right now. I'm okay. cracking this polluted delta. I feel like I'm, Logan says I feel like I'm watching a debate tournament. <laughs> <laughs> Man, I don't have this anything is, to offer profit. This is me and Alex. This is this is classic. Um, I love it. I love it. Okay, I'm gonna tap. Okay, no attacks with the dimensional infiltrator. Well, actually, I could attack someone else with a dimensional infiltrator. Now that I think about it, I do need to get yeah, damage you can in. Yeah, me with that, dude. That's fine. All right, Medina. You take two. Right, I have I'll the lowest two. life total. There was a lot of attacking yeah. that happened to me. All right, Alex, you get two tokens. Dope. And do I have to, like, exile a card or something right now? Or is that, like... No, no, that's... Case? Okay. That's a different thing. I, I keep thinking it's in jest. I keep thinking that. Uh, I'm casting Con Sphinx, and I'm passing. <laughs> okay, I see the deal makes a lot more sense now. <clears throat> I'm, I'm, I am done. I'm fine with bad right. cards. I'm going to untap. Just... Um, the cast of Avatar is going to be my spirit tokens. I guess I need to go Iroh first, though. I'm going to draw my card. I'm going to draw two. He feels spiritually. Did you comment, Kess, when uh, Joe Johnson was like, I've never, I've never seen Avatar. The other day on Twitter. Oh, oh yes. Uh, not only that, but he, uh, it was happening during our stream, and so I had him come. Uh -oh. We, I like convinced him to join the stream, and I shared my conveniently next to me at all times cutout of myself uh, with the voice box of. <laughs> <laughs> nice. So. Nice. Chat. Uh -huh. <laughs> I also well, have never watched that. I mean, to be to be fair, I still have not watched it. Yeah, but you don't watch TV. <laughs> it's like harder. I've watched, with that. I've watched Ted Lasso three times. I mean, I can tell you that. That's fair. You should That's watch Avatar: great. Last Airbender. <laughs> I'm gonna play a scroll rack. Okay. Okay. Powerful. Um, and I'm gonna activate it. Let's see. Look, activating it seems bad right now. Is, is that is scroll rack? Is it draw cards or is it look at the top? It's look. It's you put them back and it says, let's see, um, exile any number of cards from your hand face down. Put that many cards from the top of your deck onto your library. Then look at the exiles cards. You may put those on top of your library. I guess you just like swap, right? You swap what's in your hand for what's on the top yeah. of the library. Um, so I think we're going to put, I think I'm going to. I'm going to scroll rack for four. So I'll take these four and then uh, I'll put them aside, right? And then I draw four essentially uh, top of your deck into your hand. So one, two, three, four. Utter trash, just total trash. And uh -oh. then I put these on top of my deck. I think in any order, right? Okay. Um, yeah, dude, this is trash. <laughs> I haven't attacked uh, anybody. What's that? I haven't attacked so anybody. Got... Oh, and Zach said you have this. You got this. Oh, you thank it. you, Zach. I appreciate it, man. I really uh, appreciate that. I'm going to, I'm going to play a swamp and... Do I just chill on blocks? Oh, I see why you're asking about the draw. I forgot about the Consecrated Sphinx anyways. <laughs> I don't think I chill. I think I just run this. I think I just suicide this little guy right into something. But I don't want to anger Cass either. Um... You were trying to get we need Ben to, get, to anger we just, me. We just, need to gang, we just need to gang up on him. That's all That's all that's got to happen here, guys. All right, no, I'll, let you, I'll let you hit me for, for two uh, so you can get a land. Okay. 
And I'm, I'm thinking, though, the problem is that I just put cards on top of my deck without, like, having the foresight of, um, of like, the fact that I'm going to shuffle. And so That's that makes it... <laughs> Oh, no. <laughs> you know, no, I had that foresight. I'm like, okay, I'm going to put these out because I'm going to shuffle them. And then I was like, I thought I would draw better cards. <laughs> so now I, I drew these cards, and I'm like, I don't think I want these cards. I'd rather have those ones I put on top now. Um, you know what? Yeah, thank you, Zach. I'm gonna I'm gonna get the land because like, let's keep the game moving. So I'm gonna attack you, Zach, for two. This I'll is gonna you. trigger the sword of the animist, and I'm gonna go get. Live without fear, Tony says. I am living without fear. No fear. What up, Joe? I'm doing a whole lot of nothing. I need a, equipments. Hmm. I did play a ritual into an internal witness into a ritual, <laughs> so <laughs> I'm much farther ahead than I was supposed to be. Oh, Alex, I had some people respond to my post earlier today, the one we were talking about on the phone. Jack Sparrow was something people respond with. Ooh, I, that's a good that's a good point. That's a super iconic performance. That one's really, really strong. That, one's, that yeah, one you forget because it was like 2003. Well, like, yeah. I mean, Gandalf? Yeah, I, I agree. I don't think Gandalf's performance is as iconic, though. I, I feel like, well, no, uh, it's it's as iconic as you, Jack Sparrow, probably. You shall not pass. Like, so the the for for people who uh, Ben did not introduce the question before, just getting getting into it, we were discussing who is the most iconic actor, or who is the most what is no, the most no. iconic role of the century? Performance, performance, Sing, not role, single performance. So I, my, my contention was that Heath Ledger in The Dark Knight is the most iconic acting performance of the 21st century. I just think it is. Here, here goes, Zach. Um, you played Boots. Yeah, I played Boots. Right, cool. I just need to keep Some track boot? of when people cast things because I have this really big Hydra over here. <laughs> I am going I'm to gonna, draw two on your draw. Question about uh, the yeah, control. first I'm exiling for cons okay. uh, or for uh, Outpost. Um, let's see. I can you may play that card, so I can't play the land. Uh, then I'll draw for my turn and you draw two cards. I don't even think Le Revenant is Leo's most iconic role of the century. I don't even think it's in no, his top five. Re Revenant's like I Revenant's like one of the single most he did a, like he, overrated. He did very like not saying he did a bad job. Uh he was awesome in that movie, yeah. Aloha, Sol Sol Barum. Hopefully I said that correctly. I am I have a lot of plus one planet, plus one counters in play. <laughs> That's what I'm doing right now. His uh, most iconic performance of the 21st century is definitely 100% Wolf of Wall Street. Uh, Departed, baby. But uh, did, oh, unless Titanic happened in 2001 or 1999. No, it didn't. It was 77. It was 97. 97. Okay, cool. Yep. Yeah. Uh, uh, I'm playing Hammer of Nizan. Ooh. Uh, when it enters the battlefield under your control, you may attach that equipment to a creature. It has plus two, plus zero, and indestructible. Um, what else I'm gonna do? Nope, I'm just gonna attack now. Uh, guess I'm gonna attack you for two. Uh, two, two what? Uh, first strike, menace, trample, uh, and my guy has indestructible. First strike, menace, trample, <clears throat> and it's just two. Yeah. Oh, but it is your commander. Yeah. Uh, I'll block with two of these spirit tokens. All right. Uh, I'm going to leave. Put that pressure on. Iro B. He feels the most spiritual <laughs> of these options. <laughs> um, and I'll pass. Uh, okay. I don't think I have any upkeep effects that I can think of other than tapping. Uh, drawing a card is... I will play Land of War Reborn. It gets its graft token. So so sick. Sweet. That's one of my favorite lands of all time. It's one of my favorite pieces of magic card art ever, actually. It's really good. I'll I'll, I'll bring it up for everyone. Uh, for those who don't know, this is the graft land. Yeah, it's pretty nice with that two mana dork that um when it has a counter and it's a black lotus, right? Or whatever. Um Oh yeah. Can't, incubation drip. Can't play that in this deck because it's a two drop. <laughs> Oh, that's right. <laughs> uh, there, hey, what like, up, Andrew? When I posted the list, there was a ton of people who were um, like, oh, you should play this card. And I was like, 
the big one was there was a lot of zero drops that would be so amazing in a counters deck, like all of the uh -huh. XX artifacts like Kangaroo Walker that like yeah. zero is technically an even converted mana cost, and uh, so I can't play with it. So how much mana do I have? One, two, three, four, five. So, uh, this land enters the battlefield with a plus one plus one counter on it. That's so good with uh, Primal Vigor. <laughs> I was gonna say, don't you get two plus one? Yeah, and right. then and then when they go under the creature, it'll it'll four, right? It'll become four. Oh, yeah, <laughs> so spicy. Mm -hmm. uh, one, two, three, four, five. I have five standard mana, but then I have six, set, well, six, seven, eight, nine. So I have nine mana, which is not as sick as it could be. I don't have a sacrifice effect. Hmm. With a lot of mana. How did Cass get so much mana so fast? I just don't Dude, understand. You know, it started with that guy. It started with that guy. This guy? This. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, Cass, did you, did you draw a card? Did I miss your draw step? Uh, I, you did miss the draw step, yes. So I will draw two off your draw step. Yep. Is that okay with everyone? Yeah. That's fine with me. Yeah. Okay. Uh, um, I just want to see Kess Wheel of Fortune right now. That would be absurd. <laughs> I, I did try to play with no wheels. I mean, maybe the deck needs those. <laughs> uh, as I'm now out of cards. Um, I'm just saying for the for the Sphinx. <laughs> I don't have a sacrifice thing, right? Ooh, I could make a food and sacrifice it. Um, how much mana does that cost? It doesn't... It nets me two mana no if i had the two tokens alex has so much stuff going on over there alex what's the what are like the good things you have that are making you unstoppable what's going on i'm not unstoppable i just have a big bunch <coughs> of spells uh, i have no cards in hand now i have one card that i'm debating if i want to cast i don't think i do i think i'm going to one two three play jessica mm -hmm. and then okay. one two three or i guess uh as i do that at the end of my turn uh i will then equip shadow sphere oh jessica makes this go to 17. i will then equip shadow spear to mana gorder hydra Ooh. i will then uh use jessica's ability zero ability on mana Gorg gorger hydra and then, who hasn't... Oh, all of you have attacked me. <laughs> uh, huh. Wait up. So so, so Jessica's ability... Choose Mana target Gorger creature. Hydra. Until next turn, uh, that creature would deal combat damage to one of your opponents. It deals triple that damage to that player instead. So how big is Gorger? It is a 18-18. Does it have Trample? It has Trample. <laughs> so Alex right now is able to swing at someone for 54 damage. Is that what's going on? Yeah. Yeah. They're so dead. One shot. He swings at. I get to one shot a player. <laughs> <clears throat> now the question is, which player do I one shot? Ben somehow talked his way into not get getting attacked this turn, uh, which was smart of him. <laughs> Though I could bet betray him like a, like a madman. Uh, <laughs> The mad, the mad king. Um, Zach, John, uh, <laughs> what, what would you? You know, it's it's no hard feelings if you attack me and kill me. Like I'm not gonna. Mm. Yeah, I'm not gonna flip a table, it, but you know, you, you know, might I, see little tears fall on the play mat here, like just on these cards and stuff. But you know, I'll get over it. Chat. I could be a good asset against Ben. I'm just saying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I guess, I guess. How will you assist me in defeating Ben if I don't, if I don't, uh, if I don't kill you right now? <laughs> I mean, attacking. <laughs> um, I guess, I guess. Question for chat: Who, whom should I kill? Well, I guess this feels unfair because it feels like John's got seated. The yeah, my crew's in with, the chat. What's crew. up, <laughs> people? I have some people. Hey, is there a? Is there a fog like on these channel rewards? Where's the where's the fog at? <laughs> there is a, I think there is a poll feature. Uh and I don't know how to Nope. 
I don't know how it makes it works. This, this no one knows how the pulls work. Um, all right, I'm just gonna roll. I'm gonna roll. Uh, one, two, Ben. Two, three, uh, three, four, John. Uh, five, six, Zach. What happened to our deal? It was a six. You didn't get hit. You're good. You're safe. So that's me. Yep. Uh, uh, okay. I'm sorry. The the nope. dice picked you. <laughs> it was fake. It happens. I'm blocking my one one. Nice. Uh, so that does actually cancel out two of the damage. So it's uh, or no, it cancels out one of the damage. But then Jessica, yeah, that's how that works. Yeah. So still get rickety wrecked. Um, you yeah, take seventeen times three. Jeez. Rip. And I gained that Have much fun, life. Guys. Seventeen times. How big is How big is Jessica? Uh, she comes in with. Uh, Two, two, two counters. She's a, and she's do you have any counter. flying blockers? I do. I have a goose. Have a <laughs> that goose, man. Flying. That goose. Uh, what, a silly go- what a silly goose. And then I get... Um, how much life is that? 17 times 3? That's an unfair one. amount. Oh, it's, it's 60 minus 9, so 51 plus 1. So 52. All right. Well, Alex is a villain. We can all agree. Yeah. Yeah. I think we know that now. <laughs> all right. Switch him too. Uh, let's see you're, if we can you're just not sudden spoiling or darkness. Yeah, I should definitely have darkness in this deck. Darkness would be dope. Morgan. Fog is dope. I did. I did. Are sadly, you, have to exile done, uh, Alex. Uh, the like redirect spell. Are you done? Uh, I have three ground creatures. I'm going to tur- uh, put Obosh into my hand. Uh-oh. Which one is Obosh again? He is my companion. Like, double uh, damage? He's the reason I only have one. He's the he's the companion that I'm dealing with. He's the... or uh, I'm going to go with she to make this a fully female-led squad. Uh, if a source you control... Would- with an odd converted mana cost, would deal damage to a permanent or a player. It deals double that damage to that permanent or player instead. It is a three five. Uh, Your starting deck contains only line. cards with odd converted mana costs and land cards. Clever, clever girl. Uh, done. Yes. Okay. Well, we're not long for the world here, John. That's right. Have you ever drawn any removal from the uh, the Consecrated Sphinx draws? Well, not sure about that, really. Um, <laughs> board catacombs. wipe. Board wipe. That'd be nice. Board wipe would be good. Uh, how are we going to do this? Ooh, Chris with the draw card. Who's drawing a card, Toph? <laughs> oh no! Help me, people. Well, if you if you make him have... draw a card, I'll get two. So that works. That works for me. That's great, right? Sounds like a great deal. Yeah. Medina gets a card. Ben gets two. That, that's okay, right, Alex? Yeah. yeah no, we, that's that's, that's the rules right. as they are written. <laughs> thank, you. thank you, Chris. Appreciate it. So I get two. I, I feel like I need uh-huh. to make drawing ca- a card more expensive, though. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go blue. Into here. <laughs> you could just make me drink here. water. That's a way more valuable use of your points. Or Zach. Zach's very thirsty. Yeah, dude. I'm <laughs> going to go. I'm going to go. Water. Narset Parter of Veils. Oh no! Now I can't draw any more cards. <laughs> True. Rip. I will minus down to here. Look at the top five and get a non-land. I'm creature. Digging, non-land. digging. Three. Um, wow, none of those are very good. Actually, that's kind of good now that I think about it. Oh, uh, yeah. I do get two more counters on to my Hydra. Let's get a let's let's put a brainstorm in hand here. Um. Okay. Then we will go. So many cards here. Then I will tap this underground sea. And I'll cast Brainstorm. Mm-hmm. Uh, we have now reached the point of second die on Mana Gorger Hydra. 
Two it's, cards. I don't think that's it's, it's now 21 <laughs> years old. It can go to bars. We have a boo Narset uh, <laughs> in chat. <laughs> Maybe Mana Gorger will get drunk and like forget to attack next turn. It's possible. <laughs> It has, a lot, it has a lot of heads, combat. though, so you're going to need a lot of beers to get it <laughs> to convince it to go. <laughs> it's pretty big, right? Yeah. Let's go like that and like that. Two on top here. Um, and then, Alex, I'm going to attack your by. Jessica with my two flyers. Okay, Jessica's dead. I guess he can just recast Jessica on his turn, right? She oh, works. Yeah. Costs five on my turn, yeah. Yeah, but you get more like more counters on Jessica or whatever. Yes. Um. Sure. Uh, all right, I'm gonna go to discard. Um, discarding. Let's see. So many cards. All the cards. I guess we'll discard. One, two, sure. Yeah, Zach died. I, I don't think. I don't think the rest of us are lost for the world either, though. To be honest, Three. like it's probably gonna be a pretty quick game. I know, like yeah, the the net over. negative of you y'all stopping me is that it just makes Zach have to hang out and not get to play for longer. So really, you should just let me murder everyone. That's the best fall oh. taking I've heard all night. <laughs> wow, that's pretty, uh, <laughs> pretty intense. I'm discarding. <laughs> I am discarding. <laughs> I know I've somehow turned I'm, me uh, being the done. person who killed Zach into you guys being the bad guys. If you stop. Me. <laughs> <laughs> you go for it. All right, gonna draw a card. We got a woo Narset. We got pro Narset now. We got some. We got some anti Narset and pro oh. Narset propaganda. I'm gonna before on, on your draw trigger on my consecrated sins trigger. I'm gonna crack this Verdant Catacombs. So I okay. draw the things I put back. And I'm going to put. <laughs> Fall on your sword for Zach. Swamp. Hmm. Hmm. And I will draw two on your draw. Actually, do I want to do that? No. What's cool? This deck's working, though. That's cool. Heck yeah, it is. <clears throat> yeah. Yeah, it's really sweet. Oh, who has, uh, Danny, you have to uh, target someone to hydrate. Zach has to hydrate. Uh, right <laughs> now, the Discord... I guess we, we are planning on changing that. If you subscribe, you just get access to it. I don't know how Twitch works with that. Normally, it just like it does it if you have it linked. Hmm. I think we got a scroll rack here. Yeah, I mean, there's not a whole lot of not a whole lot of play getting around Alex here. He's kind of a menace. <laughs> I can play a different deck next game, or play the same deck and see if it works a second time. Um, like I, mean, I think Jessica's Will's the MVP here. Just because, oh yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, and and it's really and, quite good. And pe uh, 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 oh yeah, yeah. Rishkar, Rishkar in this deck is yep. like bonkers. <clears throat> um, Primal Vigor right. was You're silly, but nothing like you guys could have taken advantage of it. Are you playing the thing that turns all lands into creatures too, or all creatures into lands as well? Uh, was it a Shia? Uh, I am not playing a Shia, but that's dope. I like that. I should play a Shia. I have an Ashaya. I think that could be cool. Where is a Shia right now? Oh, she's in um, Tamio. Yeah, a Shia would be cool. Sorry, guys. I'm just trying to do math. No, you're good. We're 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 just we're hanging out. Chat's at chat's just listing you know mono black uh, board wipes that you could have drawn. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm like, yeah, guys. nice, uh, nice job. Uh, and then if I do this, that'll put me at four, five. Doesn't Last really do anything. I can't get there. I can't get there. I'm gonna I'm gonna scroll rack again. Sure. 
And I'll put on top. You haven't cast any spells this turn, right? Uh, Skull, Hydra right. is currently at a, a 20, 20, a 22, 22 with uh, 21 counters. Alex, can we just get a quick, uh, while, while, while Medina's looking over his stuff here, can you just kind of run through what's on your board? You have how many cards in hand? I have two cards in hand. You know one of them is okay. Obosh the Prey Piercer. Uh, I have a Primal Vigor in play, which doubles counters and plus mm -hmm. one, plus one counters for everybody. Okay. Which just feels like a kindness. Uh, I have a 1-1 uh, a <coughs> one, one Capricorn. Um, I have a 3-3 three, three Rayhan. I have a 1-3 Goose. I have a 3-3 okay. three, three Rishkar. Uh, I got a 1-1 one, one Spirit Token. Thank you, Ben. Uh, okay. I have a Eternal Witness. And then I have a giant Hydra, and then I have a, a Shadow Sphere on that Hydra, and I have a Tapped Birds of Paradise. So, and, and Obosh doubles damage of all things Obosh you control? Obosh doubles damage of all, uh, all things that I control, basically, yeah. It's okay. a little bit more complicated than that, but not for, for all intents and purposes, correct. Cool. Okay, I put these on top. Um, still looking pretty bad. Pretty grim. Pretty grim. It's a, it's a, oh, all of my lands are swamps too. Urberg's in play. That's convenient to know. <laughs> a rip. <laughs> um, it's actually. I mean, it's good. It's good to know. Need some mono black board wipe tribal. Yeah, I need some. I need a board wipe. There's a there's a few in the deck, but I can't. I just can't find it. You know, it's like what 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 do I do? You know, just sit here and die. Um, all right, sweet. Um, I am gonna attack Kess with my tutu to trigger my swamp getter. So you can block that if you want. Oh, I'll take two. <laughs> I'm at eighty six. Right. It's a trap. <laughs> He's it's got him. Got him. Damn. Yeah, he's a. You're at eighty six now. Take that. <laughs> all right, I'm done after that. Uh, all right, I will untap. All is dust, Oblivion Stone, Nev's disc. Any tutors? I do have a tutor. I do have a tutor thanks to Jacob. I'll show you my sweet tutor. Because, um, you know, it's so awesome. Uh, oh, I, I drop cards. One, two, three, four, five... Did you draw a card already? Oh, I should. I did draw a card. I will draw two. Got him. Damn. Never did Love to see it. it. Con Sphinx is so nuts. <laughs> like, it is. <clears throat> oh, that, that's hot. Isn't that sweet? Very much so. But you have to draw the tutor. Oh, by the way, I don't have the tutor in my hand. <laughs> uh, I'll cast Dude, Obosh. Oh no. It will correspond. Mm -hmm. mm. Casting Obosh. It's going to double all your damage, right? Yes. Yeah, let's counter it. Commander Drain. Yes! Cool. Uh, I will then cast Jessica. Oh, triple the damage, I guess. Mm -hmm. Reasonable, reasonable stuff. Is that four six? Now it's at eight. Are you good with Jessica? <laughs> ben? Jessica's good, yeah. All right. Uh, she comes in with Jessica is is target creature correct? It, it it makes one of your creatures. Yes, correct. Um, I will target uh Managorge Hydra. Mm -hmm. I will swing <laughs> at you, Ben. With the Managorge Hydra. Yes. Hmm. I'm going to. <laughs> this is fine. <laughs> Slaughter Pact. Oh. Oh. Hello. Uh, two counters go up. On the Hydra. On the Hydra. Yeah, because you cast a spell. Sure. <sighs> Does it not die? It, it'll die. Give me a second. <laughs> Fun things are gonna happen first. That's cool. Cool. It'll die. Trigger show. Sure. I'm not even playing it. I feel attacked. <laughs> Logan, <laughs> cracking me up, guys.
At least you get a bunch of mana, Ben. Yeah, I was about to say, you get the mana from the, the drain to help pay for the, the pack. Yeah. Well, you can't pay for the pack with it because then your upkeep, but later you can replace oh. the mana. Yeah. I'll be able to like at least cast like my commander and stuff. Hmm. That's interesting that there there's a lot of thinking going on. Alex must have something up his sleeve. Oh, no, oh, I, just have to, I just have to pick a creature for all these plus one, plus one counters to go to. Wait, they're all oh. going to go to another creature? Yeah, Rayhan, let's Why? look at my other commander that you haven't read. <laughs> Man. Rayhan. Rayhan. <laughs> Rayhan. Ewe gets an upgrade. Target creature. Okay, I got it. Okay. Um, I will make this Birds of Paradise into... A oh wow, thirty plus sixty times two is sixty minus two is fifty eight. So a I'm gonna I'm going to respond. Oh okay. And you targeting your bird of paradise? Yes. I will give a I will give two one one creatures to Medina. Thank you. I appreciate that. And I will chain a vapor your bird in response to the targeting with the counters. Hmm. And you are able to sacrifice a permanent, if you like, to copy the spell. A land, right? Uh, you return target on land permanent, then that player may sacrifice a land. Yes, if you sacrifice a land, you can copy the spell. But then you can sacrifice a land to copy it again. Correct. Got it. Uh, so Manic Horger's dead. Um, Birds of Paradise goes to my hand. 39, 39, 30. Wait. Uh... Yes, and so this leaves, those counters go away. Yep. Cool. Uh, I'm done. I have now drawn Alex's Wrath. There's no question about that. All right. That's true. This um, is true. I think it's going to come for you. One tap. I will upkeep, pay for the pact with... We give you Medina, you get two more 1-1s. One yes. <laughs> oh man, my army is coming in strong. One one city. <laughs> signet, signet, and then river tears. It's flying out of the battlefield. Okay, this pact has been paid for. We'll draw. Um, let's go ahead and activate this Narset. Mm-hmm. Look at the top five. Five. That wasn't very good. This force of negation, I guess. Um, I have four colorless floating currently. Uh, that's how much Obosh costs, right? Or is it five? Five. Obosh is dead. But Obosh costs four or five to cast from my the mana drain. Oh, you five. You get five mana. I get five. Okay. Yeah. I'll play this exotic orchard. Because, because uh, uh, just for rules' sakes, uh, companions do not um, do not go back to the command zone when when uh, prevented from existing. Okay. Yes, okay. Um, first main phase, I will use a blue and a black. Every, are, are are all swamps still swamps? Is that a thing, yep. or are you? Yep. Yeah. Every every land is a swamp. Okay. Tap two. Cast Nimrus. Um, Alex, I'm going to attack you in the air for six. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six. Casual 80. Casual 80. Casual 80. <laughs> Companions be like, stuff. well, I tried. Um, do you have any good creatures, Alex? Uh, yeah. <laughs> What's your best creature? Probably Rishgar. <laughs> the Mador guy. Mm. Yeah, I'm gonna still get wrecked. Even though I'm like interacting, it's still not gonna go well for me, I can tell. Um Medina, do you have anything sweet over there? Yeah, I got you, Ben. What do you, <laughs> what do you got? <laughs> I I got I got some stuff, dude. 
I mean, creatures wise, what's your best creature? I'm trying to think oh, if I want to I steal a creature. One. I got one wins. No creatures. One oh, oh, you're ask- oh, 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 you're asking to like mind control a creature. Yes. Uh, yes, yes, yes. Uh, those counters on that birds. Then. <laughs> you know, I don't. Then you I don't. Mind control that, right? I don't. I don't oh, have a I great do. thing to mind control. I guess like my commander is fine, but it's just like a three three for you. Okay. Um, I'm going to preordain. I guess the move here. Scry two, and then draw. Let's uh, put those both on the box. Uh, let me look up reanimate. It might deal. Okay, and then I'm gonna go to my discard step. No, you lose uh, life, discard. not damage. Yeah. Do you do you still have two mana floating, or did you use that mana? I used it all. Okay. Um, I'm gonna toss out. Oh wait, actually no, you're right. I do still have two mana. Floating. Right, because you were gonna mana. You were gonna like mind control something, and you float it yeah, to yeah, yeah, black. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because I had it. Yeah, I mm-hmm. correct. No, no, that's not why. I had five from the. I had five from the mana drain. I used three of it to cast Nimrus. I still have two left. Okay. Um, I'm going to use that too and cast this Rune Chanter's Pike, and then mm-hmm. I will go to my discard and I will discard this. <laughs> so sad to do it, Alex. Three wishes goes to the bin. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody spiked it. Did you see that this last week on MTG stocks? There was a buyout. Three wishes oh, spiked yeah. up to to eighteen dollars. Wow! I like, and I have like five fifty of them. Um, all right. Uh, then I'm gonna be done. I pass with two mana open. And how many uh, cards do you have in hand? Seven. Okay. One of them is a force negation. Yes. yes. Uh, so can I kill Kess? Is that cool with you? If you're able oh. to, grab. <clears throat> Sweet. I'm in uh, danger. I'll play a cabal coffers. Okay. Oh. Yeah. I'm going to add uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Man, do I really want to add 10 mana right now? Do I need that 10 mana? Yeah, you do. I draw two when you draw, right? Yeah, yeah. So I'll add, I'll add 10 mana. I'm going to play Core Lash. So that'll put me at uh, 6 mana. Cool. And then I will put the boots on Corlash, which will put me to, uh, what do we got? Uh, five mana. Cool. And let's see. I will um, use four of that mana and uh, make it um, unblockable. Nice. This is, um, this is your moment to just strike Ben down. <laughs> <laughs> uh, like I'm gonna, I'm gonna give it a, a tainted strike. Yep. Oh snap! Yep. Nice. I love that. I love get, that move. You're gonna attack Ben? Is that what I heard? <laughs> no, I, I got I to attack you, man, because like I, think, I I have a better chance heads up against Ben. I I don't think I'm like I don't think I'm favored, but I think like if I let you untap, I just die. So no, I mean you've made the correct decision. <laughs> uh, I have ten in fact, and I am now dead. I have been murdered. I was so close. We did it. I love it. I love That's it. Our team got there. <laughs> All right. What's that? Sick. Ooh, hello. Okay. Hey, Raptor Pack Uh-oh. and friends. What's up? Uh, you All just right. came in time. You came just in time to see me murdered by infect damage. <laughs> um, is Swiftfoot it, Boots though. hexproof? Is that what it is? Yeah, yeah hexproof. Handy. Um, I think. What's the next play here? You have a, you have a, you have some protection here. Um, 
How many uh, instants or sorceries do you have in the graveyard? Eight, I think, currently. Maybe. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. Um, so I'm going to my coming. favorites. Here's, okay. All right. All right. Um, yeah, go for it. Here you go. Okay. Um, Wow, You're Tappy flying. with a huge raid. What's mm -hmm. up? Yeah, what's up? Whoop, Tappy! Do you have any um do you have any um flying blockers? Who me? Yeah. No. You don't. No, you're gonna you're gonna smash me for sure. It's gonna be sick. Uh all right. Um tap. Um tap. tap. Let's go keep. Let's go draw. Work for me. Move is probably just to go. I'm still here, Prophet. I'm still here. <laughs> <laughs> I miss you, Zach. <laughs> oh yeah, I guess I should make this board a little bit more clear. Remember, none of your things are being doubled now. So none of that. None of that. All right. Let's go ahead with um, one, two. How much is boots to caught to cast? Is boots boots um Boots is two to cast. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I feel like it's getting bounced. No. Well, I'm gonna cast Thieving Skydiver and take your boots. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Uh so you, you cast it for three, right? Or or uh, it's five, I guess. Four. Five mana. Well, because boots cost two to cast, right? Oh that's right, that's right. Okay. Skydiver um, costs two and I'm kicking it for two. Let me I need to learn how polls work, Carson, because we wanted to do a poll on who I should kill between John, Zach, and Ben, and instead I just had a roll die, and it was less exciting. All right, you took the boots, but they're still equipped to my guy. Yes. Yes. Correct. What's the equip cost? Two. Or no, one. Sorry about that. Okay. You got it. Is that all good? Yeah, it's all good. Cool. Um, so let's nice. equip... Keeps leaving for one while we're hanging out let's equip your boots to my let's maybe put it on nimrus seems like a good one and then all right in response to you equipping the boots to nimrus i'm going to hero downfall the nimrus your heroes then hold nimrus huh uh, Heroes Downfall, is that just like destroy or something? Exile? Yeah, destroy. Target creature, planeswalker. Uh, to Toph the Hermit. I don't know. Oh, uh, uh, Prophet oh, uh, of Aries. Sorry, I can't force on my turn, right? Uh, that's, 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 that's fine. I'll just dispel it. Okay. Um, so then it's good. So then I'll suit up the pike on the Nimrus. And let's go ahead and enter my attack step. Yep. And, and Nimrus is flying, right? You. Yep. I'll come at you. Okay. Four, five, six. Nine. Um, seven. Ten. And then it's seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. I'm coming at you for sixteen here. Uh, to to Ares, uh, as Boxer decided, we did a we did like a live. Or our last week's last week's episode of the MM cast, we had uh, Whitney and Carson <coughs> and Tappy on. Highly recommend watching; it's really fun. But Whitney, my wife, has doesn't know anything about magic, and we actually like did a blind Pepsi challenge between okay. mana value and converted mana cost on what they thought they she, they meant, and she definitely got mana value and didn't had no idea what converted mana cost meant. So I, I do think it is better uh -huh. in the long run. I may I may scroll rack and then a turn. Let's see. No, no, that's that's no good. All right, so you um, you smashed me. I'm dead to commander damage next turn, right? Mm. Yes. Okay, I'm gonna draw a card. Um, and how many blockers do you have? Just one. I have a two-one thieving skydiver right now. Yep. Okay. Uh... Haven't seen Heroes Downfall since it was in Standard. It's underrated. It's really good. I play in my black decks. 
I am mm. debating on playing Dismember in the Obosh deck because you can. It's like a two mana removal spell. Like anything that can get down a mana is like in consideration. This is crazy. This is crazy. Uh, I'm a big fan of this Rune Cantor's, Cantor's Pike, though. I think that card is underrated in Commander. It makes every Commander well, scary. Yeah, yeah, for sure. It's great. Let's see. What do we got here? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Make 11 mana. 12, 3, 4, 18 mana. You got this. You got this, John. I believe in you. Do it. Hmm. Can't quite do it, man. Can't quite do it. <laughs> I'm so avid on these meds right now. I like didn't even realize that the pike was going on my commander. I was like gonna put it on one of the creatures and just like didn't even think about it. I'm so happy <laughs> I made that mistake. <laughs> Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. Fecundity. What's your, what's everybody's favorite name for a magic card ever? Ooh, I don't even know. That's a good question. Mm. Yeah. There's a lot of sweet ones because I learned a lot of words as a kid. Like I, my vocabulary grew a lot as a kid playing Magic because there's so many cool words. Like fecundity reminds me of that, right? Like reading and like being what? Well, what does that mean? I'm trying. I think is cellar door is a card, right? Yeah, yeah. Ooh. So Nimrus, Nimrus has the Rune Chandler's Pike right now, right? And Correct. it also has the boots, right? Correct. Mm -hmm. Okay, so like. And how much commander damage you did me? Like, did you do how much commander damage did, did you do last turn? One plus two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I did ten. And is it twenty-one to to kill? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. So like, just one more instant, I'm dead. Okay. I think I think if I'm gonna be honest though, Triskaidekaphobia might be really high for me. But, on favorite. Yeah, that was one I was thinking of. of. That's a really sick one. I, I'm a big fan of Yoked Ox. That's one of my favorites. That one's good. <laughs> it's just like, yeah, you have a Yoked Ox. All right, I'm going to scroll rack for three. Okay. Uh, let's let's just scroll rack for four, because none of these are going to do anything for me. Four. We'll put these four on top. Uh, Carson said Star of Extinction, which is really good. Uh, that's a sweet one. Savage Punch. I like. I just. I just Ooh. like the bear. I just like the Savage Punch. That's a good one. Glimpse Unthinkable is pretty good. That's a great name. Yeah. Gloom Surgeon. That's a cool one. Bitter Ordeal like speaks to me a little bit. Ooh, I do like Blood Artist. Mm. That's a great one. Yeah. I also love the art on Blood Artist. I'm gonna I'm gonna detutor. Ooh, it that tutor. Detutor spicy. Oh. It that uh -oh. it that <clears throat> phrase is such a good choice. I gotta just I gotta just stop you in your tracks on that one, because what if you get some uncounterable thing? I could be totally boned. Oh, yeah. We'll, we'll we'll use the force negation. Do you know okay. I have. So it gets exiled, right? The uh the the card, the counter spell that I use does, but the force oh, okay, negation okay, not the, the not the, okay. Um Oh, and that's my first spell on your turn, so I get to look at the top two and put one end of my hand on the other in the graveyard. No! Sick. Okay, so... <laughs> I'll put the ponder in the graveyard, and I'll put the, this other one in my hand. Um, how do... Okay, so... Uh, D-Tutor is also exiled. Okay, that's what I thought, yeah. All right, so let me... Um, I'm going to... You're like, let me cast something and don't counter it this time, please. <laughs> let me try to cast something. I'm going to go ahead and go with the um, Cabal Coffers and make 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. 11 mana. Um, All right. I'll make uh, Corlash Unblockable. Okay. 
So that will give me... I think the issue is I have chat popped out, Carson. So it's not, like, it doesn't have all of the normal options. Uh, is there a way to do... Oh, sorry about that. Let me see if there's a way to do this without making the 11 mana right now. Um, yeah, I'm going to do it that way. I'm going to make 11 mana with these. With these here. Not make 11 mana, but I'll make them unblockable with these these here. And then um, I will attack you with my team. How much damage are you coming at me for? Um, let's see. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and then Corlash, which is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. So 11 from Corlash, and then um, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. 17 total. Yeah, I'll just take no no blocks. All right, this will trigger. Uh, Sword of the Animus will trigger. So you got to land. Uh -huh. All right. And you'll take 17. Sounds good. I go to 18. And are you tapped out? Uh, Corlash is no, at 12, I, 12 I, I have, damage. Um, I have a Cabal Coffers that I can activate. With lots of mana floating or... No mana floating, but I'm going to activate the Cabal Coffers to get a bunch of mana right now. Okay. Okay, so I'll make a bunch of mana. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So I'll make 12 mana. Um, I'll cast Bloodchin Fanatic. What card is that? It's, uh, it's a warrior. It's three mana, and um, it uh, I can sacrifice another warrior, and target player loses X life, and I gain X life. Where X is the sacrifice creature's power. Is that is it when you cast it or when it enters the battlefield? When I, well, I have to pay two to do it. Like the, the sacrifice thing. Yeah. But so so I'm saying is it is it a kicker cost or is it when it enters the battlefield? No, or I when can does just do it over and over again. It's an activated ability. Sorry. It's an activated ability. Okay, gotcha, yeah. gotcha, gotcha. So in response to you casting Blood Chin Fanatic. Yep. I am going to deadly rollick away Corlash. He's your big he's your big boy, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay. So Deadly Rollick says what? Uh, if you control commander, you may cast a spell without paying its mana cost to exile target creature. Oh, exile it. Hmm. Because okay. that's the thing you were gonna be able to sacrifice to kill me, right? Right, right, right. So before this comes into play, you're gonna do that. Um Correct. Yep. Yep, okay. So it gets exiled. I'll put it in my command zone. Okay. Okay. I'll recast it for six. Hey. Do you um, have the mana to then sacrifice it and kill me still? I have the mana to sacrifice it, but I don't think I kill you. Let's see. Um, because what do I have? So five, it, it's, it's four. This is uh, six. So that's, uh, sorry, six. Oh. 9, 10, 11. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Yeah, that'll leave me one black mana floating. Yeah, I'll sacrifice it and deal you 12. Okay, so I go to 6. Yeah, and I'll gain 12. It'll be my command zone. All right, go ahead. Okay, okay I will untap. Keep. Uh, do you have any flying blockers? I do not. Well, who are you targeting, Danny? Hmm? Bye. And then I guess I'll come at you for the full compliment. Everything in okay. here. Okay, and uh, how big is your commander right now? Currently, my commander is one, uh, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Okay, it's, so uh, it is eleven. Okay. And deadly relic does six. not get exiled, right? Just it's just a uh, nope, chills in the ground. Okay. Yeah, yeah, you got me. You got, you got me. Sick. All right. Pike man, Pike gets the job done. One of my favorite cards of all time. GGs. Nice work with the pike. 
Yeah, e- powerful. E- really, either way, I won because either Ben lost, which I already <laughs> told you, or John John lost, and I get revenge for him murdering me. So, <laughs> how's everybody doing on time? Are we Are we going for round two or no? I think we can. Do I'm one. good for. I can do another. I can do another one. We're before. We're before Alex? the nine thirty line. I think we can do one one more. Uh, can we? Um. Oh man, I need like I need like six minutes. Can we have like a six minute interim? All right. Uh, yeah, we can, yeah. Do, we can do a six. I know. I will, I will, I will. In the in the meantime, quick. chat. Uh, well, I guess I'll just play the same deck again. Uh, I'll, I'll do Dina next week <clears throat> because I forgot to hit the record button. So the second game will be the one that is on YouTube. 